Hi, this is Jason from Horrific Nightmares, and it's time for another Positive Spin. Today we're going to be talking about the much-hated 2019's Black Christmas. Uh, my relationship with this movie is I rented it when it first came out because all I heard was trash about it. I was like, I can't be that bad. So I rented it, and I watched it. And I do a segment every year called The 12 Days of Christmas, and I wanted to include this on The 12 Days of Christmas. So, fortunately, I bought it for pretty cheap. And I reviewed it for 12 Days of Christmas. You guys can check that out if you'd like. And I watched it with Joe this time. Now, I am not a fan of this film. Anyone who knows me and has watched the Super Slash Brothers knows that this is not one of my favorite films of all time. As a matter of fact, it might be one of my least favorite. But we're going to put a positive spin on Black Christmas. Okay, one of the things I noticed right away was I liked the opening scene with the fraternity looking all gothic and everything. And right from there, you go to a, a girl walking back to her sorority, and she's being, um, she thinks she's being chased by a guy or followed, and it turns out she was just imagining things. And then she gets killed, and the kills, the kill was really cool because it was like a snow angel kind of kill, because he was killing her and she was waving her arms around, and it ended up making a snow angel, so I thought that was pretty cool. Uh, the college is Hawthorne College, and it's absolutely gorgeous. It's a beautiful college. It kind of has a kind of like an old um, flair to it. Uh, this has a really good winter feel, and with the lights and the snow and everything, it does feel like Christmas. So, any horror movie that is set at Christmas time, that's genuine. Generally a plus for me. I love the fraternity costumes and the masks. Now the masks apparently were supposed to be Hawthorne, the guy who founded the college, and they wore these black robes. And I thought that was really cool. It, it looked menacing. Um, I love the sorority house. I think the sorority house is absolutely gorgeous. It's really really pretty and um it's huge it's got the columns in the front it's really cool uh the frat house is awesome looking as well uh the christmas light kill had i liked it because it kind of had uh exorcist three vibes because it had somebody walking real quick after this girl and kind of strangled her with lights even though it was a cutaway kill. And they did make reference to the original Black Christmas by having the address be 1974 Elm Road. Uh, that's the best that I could do with this one. Um, there are positives to be had in here. I think if the story was centered around maybe a horror film or a slasher film. I think it would have affected me a little bit differently, but as it is, that is my positive spin on Black Christmas. Check out Joe's Positive Spin, and if you like what you see in here, hit that like button and subscribe. And until next time, peace.